So we've turned the corner, as you can tell it's still raining, it's a lovely day. I'm free up and it turns out if I film Sam, he plays better. So I've stopped filming him. <laughs> and he's missed some little putts and I'm now free up at the turn, so no more filming of Sam. <laughs> I will film this tee shot though, because it's been a while. Uh, I'm seven over, gross, which I will take being that these conditions are not favourable at all. Uh, and Sam is a lot over. 11 over. After nine holes, so I'm just one behind my handicap, not too far away, or I might be on it, I'm not really sure actually. My handicap's weird, seven, 13 since I'm a seven or six front nine or back nine. Anyway. Let's play some golf, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the yardage, 330 yards to say. 318. Yeah, you know, I can't see a lot, my vision's pretty blurry. You call that snap hook in the beers? <laughs> snap hook, yeah. Raining a lot. You're never a pain, Sam. You are never a pain. Certainly see more of a hole from everywhere. Right, that's right back then. Yeah, just like that. That's why I don't bother filming you anymore. <laughs> See? Just play out for the cameras, that's, that's all That's ridiculous. Is. That has just proven my point. That's I right. play worse, you play better. <laughs> uh, oh well, see you in the clubhouse, <laughs> YouTube. Still raining. Actually, this point now that I'm filming, it's less rain, but it is still raining. Uh, you probably think I'm a bit mad always playing in the rain. I'm sure some of you do. Hardcore. The hardcore play in the rain. But <clears throat> certainly because of YouTube, we always try and plan in vlogs so like a song's available. Sam, like we book it in advance. Like, oh yeah, alright, let's have a game, you know, book a day off, we'll go and have a play and film and this, that and the other. And when it comes round, you sort of crap weather, and obviously this winter's been the worst. So bad the amount of rain we've had. Storm after storm. Yeah. Just comes around you're like, oh, it's a shame, but it's still gonna play. And the way I look at it is the fact that I'm playing in the rain, yes, it's crap, and there's lots of, you know, dodgy lies. Or... But if you gain anything from it at all, then it's a bonus, right? Because not a lot of other people are playing in this today. Uh, so it almost feels like you're gaining something on everybody else, because no one else is playing in this weather. So hopefully it's going to put me in a better position for the future, for the rest of the summer, what I mean future, the summer. So yeah, but anyway, Sam's turning it on a bit now and he's just gone back to one down. So I'm one up and we're on a shot hole, the 12th. He's pushed his out a bit right here, Could be in a spot of bother. Let's hit a good one up the left. My ball was literally wobbling on the tee when I was swinging, which was odd. Uh, but like I say, this is a shot hole. Sam is one down. Pretty sure we're both in play. Yeah, I found mine. He is still wandering about for his. Ah, oh, Sam, you're right down here. Sorry, I just pointed with you. Sam has nailed one up the right hand side. I must have drawn back lovely. Uh, yeah, he's just on the edge of the fairway, whereas I am not. Here I am, and there Sam is. I shouldn't film, should I? I shouldn't film him! So two thirds of the course played, and we're all square. Yeah. Not once have we halved the hole. It's a good thing we're not filming it, because it'd be pretty boring. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> no real long holes have been putted in. <laughs> no long putts have been holed. Oh, it's a bit grotty. But we love golf. We love play. We just did. Yeah, putt balls at 219 or something. Something like that. Drive off tee went out right. Uh, 50 degree in and about 100 yards. And then sunk the putt for a birdie. Ching. Who will win, Tom or Jerry? <laughs> yeah, are you Jerry because you're the smaller one? Still, fun. I played it well. I hit yeah, a really good tee shot straight down the middle. Had 90 yards. Win, so I took an easy pitch and wedge. Put it in closer than Sam. Right up to the edge and made a four. So. Arguably rubbish, but good. So there we go. Golf is fun. 14th hole. There, cutting no display. No idea how hard to hit it. It's just like, just gonna hit it. See what happens. Yeah, well, you saw mine, and I had to go for a fair bit of water on my side. Yeah. Um, so I obviously gave mine a little willy. Yeah, I thought I'll give mine a willy. You, you had less water to go through. Well, did it? And you wellied it off the green. Yeah. G greened. So back all square. Yeah. Loving life. It's still raining, by the way, if anyone noticed. It's still raining. 15 holes played, not a single half. This is a cracking hole. I don't know how much you can see of it. Lots of water, par three. The yardage is 155 to the pin. This is definitely lying, although the yellow is off the white, so that makes sense. Uh, yeah, Sam just making a bogey on the par five after I made a seven of the duff out of the rough. Duff out of the rough and uh, he's back one up and playing pretty steady golf, I would say. Yeah, it's probably now. a lot better. Yeah. Better since Wayne said I can't play when the camera's not on me. Yeah. Um, yeah, things have improved significantly, so I'm pretty happy. Curse of the commentator. Curse of the commentator. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So let's hopefully so put one on. post on him. Go draw me two up. Oh my god, we're at the business end. That would be good. It's when the nerves get the best of me there and they'll shine down to the water. Never! <laughs> uh, no point in filming two shots because you can't see where it lands anyway. Well, he sort of called it. He said, nice to win this hole and take it to Dormy, and that's what he did. 
You did a fantastic chip actually, very high risk. Floppity jalopity. <laughs> Straight into about four foot, five yeah, foot. Probably. Hold the putt for a three. I was short of the green, chipped up, two putted for a four. <sighs> so, Dormy two, two holes to play. That's what Dormy two means. Brilliant. I don't wait. That's so clever. Oh, I made a birdie, a little 150 yard par four. Sam uh, was in the bunker on his tee shot, played a really good bunker shot, just missed the putt. I actually had to hold uh, probably a 10 foot putt for par. Well, not par, birdie. Birdie, it was a birdie, officially. Uh, so, Dormy won. All the ball. So I am near the green in three. Whether I'm on or not, I can't tell. It's sort of gone over a bunker. I might even be in the bunker. Sam is just here for two, playing his third. He's got into a very, very nice GUR area, which he's very lucky with. Hang on a minute, another golf ball here. Yes, it's all GUR. It's not your tee shot here then. Are you triple free? Lovely ball. <laughs> uh, so you would stay in line. Well, it's the nearest point of relief, no nearer the hole. Which, arguably, I hate to say it, is probably the other side of these trees. Yeah. Well, it would be up here. GURN's got that stake at the end. Rules. The GUR would run from all the way around there. So being up amongst this, the right. GUR. Surely it finishes in line with that stuff, with that Yeah, well, yeah, well, but all this would be GUR as well. So I would say you take a line from there to the water. I mean, you could drop it in there, but that's where you were anyway. Wouldn't it? It comes around there. Because all because they're trying to protect this, aren't they? Yeah. So I would say it's the nearest point of relief, no nearer the hole, but they've obviously fenced up to the edge of the tree line. So I would then say the tree line is the GUR. So the other side of the tree line would be the nearest point of relief. Does that make sense? Yeah. Would you agree with that? Oh, that's dream shot through from there. Look at that! Is it? It's going to be one of those trees. Some dreams are made of, isn't it? A little punch through there. That is not what dreams are made of. No, it is what dreams are made of. But I would say this is your area of droppage. Around here, yeah. Fantastic drop. Ooh, is it playing? Is it playing? Will it move? You uh. are? Uh. <laughs> well, that is a fun shot through there. Oof. All to play for. That is. Is that something you'd agree with, YouTube? Please uh, comment below if you think that is the correct play. As you can see, you've got GUR signs and uh, red rope all the way around the greens. And obviously all this nice new turf, new bunker, as the GUR, I would say that that is from the trees through to this edge, the nearest point of relief. is probably in the middle of the trees, but because I'm friendly, I'm letting him have a shot through to the green. Because I'm friendly like that. Whoever gets Sam Horrigan in the charity day will be a very lucky, very lucky people. He's a lovely boy. He's a good friend of mine, and he knows how to play golf. Always competes, yeah. unless you're playing Hamworth or the Oxfordshire. Yeah, no, I don't like it. <laughs> Do not like golf in those days. What's going through the brain, Sam Oregon? What is going through the brain? I'm actually thinking of taking it out wide oh. and hooking it over that tree. That does sound fun. <laughs> that's, my, that's my thought at the moment. But... It's lovely and framed through there though, isn't it? Yeah, but I, um, I don't think I've got that shot in the locker. 
just keep it below these trees and hit it like 100 yards. You do like a right to left swing as well, don't you? I do, yeah. Oh, oh I could end up over there somewhere. Yeah. Where are you? I couldn't possibly say. I mean, I might just get my finger out and try and find it. Because that might have some implications as to what I hear. If I can even see it. I reckon you were long. But I can't see it. I mean, he's going to have to get up and down from wherever you are. Yes. Correct. I don't know how far it was. <laughs> I think I said that. <coughs> What's at the back? Nothing. Oh, that's just the patent green. Yeah, patent green, which is OB. You think I was long, do you? Are you sure? You think I'm sure? I don't know. I don't know where it is. <laughs> I'm trying to get in my head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all to play for at 18. Oh. All to play for. But also, that's exactly going to be slightly lower than that. If anyone's worried about pace and play, you don't have to worry because there's literally no one oh, yes, on the golf course really with only two idiots yeah. chose to play the game. I could literally stay until five o'clock tonight and still no one would be here. <laughs> Wind is pushing. It is. Wind is from right to left. Sam does like to hit a draw. Enough club, though, is, the question. is it going to be enough? What are you hitting? What have you got in hand? I think 50 degrees. 50 degrees. Just thinking about basically slinging it around there. And then up over this tree. So over this tree here. So you're going to go under these branches here, yeah. but over this tree here yeah. and sling it around there. So it's not too much of a sling. I like what you're doing there. I like that. a two-parter now because of this video. <laughs> I'm just thinking, is it going to be enough club? It's like playing a Ryan Tricky, isn't it? <laughs> it means a lot though, doesn't it? Let's be honest. It means a lot. Debut win on the DGS Golf Vlogs channel. Doing it for his team, to prove to his team that he has what it takes. Yeah, I've got it. You've got this. I don't even know where my ball is, might be lost. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. seven minutes. <laughs> well, there it is, splash. <laughs> he's, he's, he's raging, he's raging. Pinned it. <coughs> that one, didn't you? Oh well. At least you're dropping nearer now. Nine. Huh? That is true. See you on the other side. Probably tough to see him from back here, but he is over the other side of the water there. At the moment, I don't know where my ball is. So the drama continues. It might be right, it might be long, but I'd be surprised if I was. He's hit. Lovely high ball. He's coming in now. Boom. Yeah, it's good. So he's one, two, into the rough and three into the water four drop and then five and now i need to find my golf ball which isn't looking great at all maybe it's short well it's not underground in the wall on the green he thinks i was long and he might be right you know unless i sit over there no i'm in the bunker i'm in the bunker I'm in the bunker, all to play for. Well gang, that did not go so well. I'm quite upset about it, if I'm honest. But I thought I was, uh, I thought I'd pitch like here and I was going to have another tricky chip. Actually, I'm on the green so that's not too bad. Wayne, 
pit set, that's how he thins it into the bank again. That is out, that's a good shot. That is a very good shot. Who is this guy? I think it's because he made me drop from where he made me drop from. <laughs> I mean, look at this. It's a joke. What's this for? What are you there for? I don't think I can win anyway. Huh? Um, I don't think so. I think that was. I think that was my fault. Bunker yeah. shot up and down. Second time I got up and down over a bunker today. Lovely, jubbly. Don't see many of them, do you, ladies and gents? You do on the tour, but not on the DGS tour. Uh, so he was one. Two duff. So why shoot the trees? Two duff. Three in the water, four drop, he's had five. So playing six. All square! Game finishes all square! He's fuming, he's fuming about it. After that tee shot as well, I hit. I literally hit about a 30 yard tee shot. That's cost you, isn't it? Well, we haven't got it's too busy out here. I'll be doing stuff like that. Great finishing hole, though, isn't it? This is a, a round ruiner or succeeder. Yeah, not if your name's Wayne Dewey. Finish with a five with that t shirt. I'm very happy. Very happy man. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> well, mate, it stopped mate. raining. We should have teed off now, really. We should have, yeah. We could have had the afternoon, but... Yeah, never mind. Still, thank you very much for the round. Nice to have a... Yeah, uh, pleasure. A it's full round of you in a video. Yeah, it's really nice. Which is nice. Yeah, it's lovely. I thoroughly enjoyed it, even though the rain and the negative scoreline. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but it finished in a draw, yeah. and we it didn't have wasn't. a single half Not the whole round. Half. Not a single half. Amateur golf at its best. Yeah. Yeah, thank you very much, mate. I think it was fair. Fair result, really. I think it's fair result, too. Yeah, I agree. We played some good golf and some bad golf. But I can tell you, YouTube, I can guarantee you, if you want to play golf and it's wet everywhere, come to Hurtmore. It's a reciprocal of ours, so Crane Valley, so I don't actually know what the green fee is, but I imagine it's around 30, 35 quid mark at the weekends. But you can play nice conditioned golf here. Like, there's some really short holes. Our scores weren't brilliant today, but conditions, weather conditions, wind's been strong, rain, rain has been a bloody nightmare. But the uh, actual course itself, fantastic. Like I say, they've still got buggies going out. Yeah, so it's bone dry. Absolutely yeah, bone dry, isn't it? Insane. Yeah, it's credit to them. Credit to Hurtmore. Thank you for watching. And uh, see you in the next one. Mwah, mwah, mwah.